have not really been uploading videos as often as before. I really wanted to make sure that I will be uploading more often today, especially that I'm still planning for the ideas of my videos in my new YouTube channel. That is what I'm doing. And I'm also taking a slight break from this YouTube channel because I also wanted to explore more around the outside world just so that it can give me better instincts of having better ideas in my mind for my new YouTube channel. Today is a special day because today is the birthday of one of the biggest YouTubers in the world. Mr. Beast. He turns 24 today. He has recently surpassed 90 million subscribers about two months ago and is probably close into surpassing 100 million subscribers. Which if I were to predict, it will be probably by July or August of 2022 when he will be surpassing 100 million subscribers. He's currently 95 million subscribers, which means 5 million subscribers left. A brief history about his YouTube channel. He started making videos way back in 2012. His first videos were probably Minecraft stuff. And then he started making Pokemon stuffs and random stuffs. That didn't get him many views. He kept trying and there was this one time when he finished high school and then he went to the community college in this case. He didn't really want to go to the community college. He just acted like he went to community college because his mother told him to do so. He just kept acting like he's going to the community college. He, he never went to community college. He was just there because he wanted to make videos because that's his passion. His mother was actually doubtful about whether or not he's going to make it through the YouTube industry. That is why his mother begged him to go to community college and get him a safe job. But Mr. Beast didn't follow her advice. And he just kept making videos and then eventually his mother found out that he didn't go to community college his mother got pissed off this kind of the turning point was when i graduated from high school and my whole life i was like i want to be making enough money by the time i graduated to do this full time and i wasn't i was still only making a couple hundred bucks a month so i graduated high school and my mom was like either move out or go to a community college and I didn't have enough money to move out, but I really just, I hated school with a passion. But she forced me to go to community college, and that was, that was the worst thing ever. Like, that, that made me hate life. Like, borderline suicidal. I just can't stand, like, having to just sit there and listen to this dumb stuff and listen to some teacher read out a book. So what I did was I would act like I was going to community college, but I would just work on videos in my car and edit and stuff like that. I had straight <laughs> zeros. And so now the clock had started, because, oh, like, no. once my mom found out, I was screwed. Uh, At that time, he didn't have money to drop out, so that is why he was just acting like he's going to community college so that he will earn these few bucks because he never liked school. And at that time, when he finally had enough money to drop out and move to another place, he did so. He told his mother, he convinced his mother that he didn't go to community college ever since. That's one of the things, but that didn't make him look like he had failed everything because he started making money to make more videos and that's his process. He kept making videos and eventually his videos became really better. That makes him happy to hear. And the thing about it is that he just keeps making videos until he finds even better ideas where many of us cannot easily achieve. That's why he started making videos where he gives away a huge amount of cash to others just at the same time entertaining us. He has a really w great audience retention in his videos that makes it easier for us to watch his videos till the end. Many accomplishments we found from Mr. Beast. I've never seen any YouTubers do this insane stuff like one who has who went from 50 million subscribers to 100 million subscribers within three years and mr beast will be one of the fastest youtubers to ever reach this threshold all of it because of one thing 
passion matters more. Whatever you have learned in school, whatever you've learned in school will only help you with your knowledge and getting to the path where you will only get a safe job, a safe career, where you will never have your way of taking risks in getting there. And what it's like to succeed in your passion is whatever that you do, you have committed, you are passionate with every step that you will be taking in your passion or in your career. And in this case, if this is the thing that you really want to do, no matter how much pain and effort it takes to get from there, from this to this, you will never have to ever have to struggle quitting every one of them because you are committed. That is exactly what is behind Mr. Beast's way of succeeding in life and that's that's how. That is exactly how he has made it to surpassing 95 million subscribers, a little bit less than 3 or 4 months from now he's surpassing 100 million subscribers. One of the YouTubers with more than 100 million subscribers within the third quarter of 2022. I'm proud of his success. It's like it's incredible to even know about that. That's it. Once again, happy birthday, Mr. Beast. Keep making better videos. Maybe soon we'll collab with each other. Maybe make the world better. Okay, now. We're gonna have a little bit of adventure. We're heading more than 30 kilometers southwest. Uh, we're gonna just have fun in there. Just, just a little bit of an adventure. Holy moly, what's up? What's up with the car? Okay, one of the tires fell down the concrete. It took a little bit of time. Uh, takes a lot of process and these guys thank you guys that, that took like 20 minutes all right we arrived here because we are going to be celebrating the birthday of the father of my dad you feel hot here it's just hot but not really hot goodbye that's all that it is spend so much time in this house you know, we don't own this house. This is like the house of the friends of my parents. Probably the owner of this house would be the cousin of my dad if this is what I've ever thought so far. Okay, two hours later, we're heading out again. We're heading out again. We're dining here. Oh my god, is this? definitely enjoyed today's adventure and that's all for today's video Day